The Indian Institute of Technology Kharagpur IIT Kharagpur or IIT KGP, is a public engineering institution established by the Government of India in 1951. It was the first of the IITs to be established, and is recognized as an institute of national importance by the Government of India. As part of Nehru's dream for a free self-sufficient India, the institute was established to train scientists and engineers after India attained independence in 1947. It shares its organizational structure and undergraduate admission process with sister IITs. IIT Kharagpur has a 8.5 square kilometers, 2100 acres campus and is residence to about 22000 inhabitants. The students and alumni of IIT Kharagpur are informally referred to as KGPans. IIT Kharagpur holds two student festivals, Spring Fest, Social and Cultural Festival, and Kshati, Techno Management Festival. Topic: History. Topic: Foundation. With the help of Bidhan Chandra Roy, Chief Minister of West Bengal, Indian educationalists Hamayan Kabir and Jogendra Singh formed a committee in 1946 to consider the creation of higher technical institutions for post-war industrial development of India. This was followed by the creation of a 22-member committee headed by Nalini Ranjan Sarkar. In its interim report, the Sarkar Committee recommended the establishment of higher technical institutions in India, along the lines of the Massachusetts Institute of Technology and consulting from the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign along with affiliated secondary institutions. The report urged that work should start with the speedy establishment of major institutions in the four quarters of the country with the ones in the east and the west to be set up immediately, on the grounds that West Bengal had the highest concentration of industries at the time. Roy persuaded Jawaharlal Nehru, India's first Prime Minister, to establish the first institute in West Bengal. The first Indian Institute of Technology was thus established in May 1950 as the Eastern Higher Technical Institute. It was located in Esplanade East, Calcutta, and in September 1950 shifted to its permanent campus at Hajli, Kharagpur 120 km southwest of Calcutta. Hijli had been used as a detention camp during the British colonial rule in India. To keep Indian freedom fighters captive, IIT Kharagpur is the third oldest technical institute in the West Bengal state after Indian Institute of Engineering Science and Technology Shibpur and Jadavpur University, established as Bengal Technical Institute in in 1906, when the first session started in August 1951, there were 224 students and 42 teachers in the 10 departments of the institute. The classrooms, laboratories and the administrative office were housed in the historic building of the Hajli detention camp, now known as Shahid Barwan, where political revolutionaries were imprisoned during the British rule. The office building had served as the headquarters of the Bomber Command of the U.S. 20th Air Force during World War II. Topic. Early developments 
The name, Indian Institute of Technology, was adopted before the formal inauguration of the Institute on 18 August 1951 by Maulana Abul Kalam Azad. On May 18, 1956, a bill, Bill No. 36 of 1956, was introduced in Lok Sabha to declare the institution known as the Indian Institute of Technology, Kharagpur, to be an institution of national importance and to provide for its incorporation and matters connected therewith. The motto of the Institute, Yogacarmasu Kausalam, is taken from the Bhagavad Gita, Chapter 2, Verse 50, and it has been translated by Sri Aurobindo as Yoga is skill in works. On 15 September 1956, Indian Institute of Technology Karagpur, Act, 195 of Parliament received the assent of the President. Prime Minister Nehru, in the first convocation address of IIT Karagpur in 3056, said, Here in the place of that Hajli detention camp stands the fine monument of India, representing India's urges, India's future in the making. This picture seems to me symbolical of the changes that are coming to India. The Shaheed Bawan was converted to a museum in 1990. The Srinivasa Ramanujan complex was incorporated as another academic complex of the institute with Takshashila starting operation in 2002, Vikramshila in 2003 and Nalanda in 2012. Topic. Administration IIT Kharagpur shares a common visitor, a position held by the President of India, and the IIT Council with other IITs. The rest of IIT Kharagpur's organizational structure is distinct from that of the other IITs. The Board of Governors of IIT Kharagpur is under the IIT Council, and has 13 members that include representatives of the states of West Bengal, Bihar, Jharkhand and Odisha, in addition to other members appointed by the IIT Council and the Institute Senate. Under the Board of Governors is the Institute Director, who serves as the Chief Academic and Executive Officer of the IIT. He is aided by the Deputy Director. Under the Director and the Deputy Director are the Deans, Heads of Departments, Registrar, President of the Students' Council, and Chairman of the Hall Management Committee. The Registrar is the Chief Administrative Officer and oversees day-to-day -day operations. He is the custodian of records, funds, and other properties of the Institute. Under the charge of the Heads of Departments HOD, are the faculty, full-time professors as well as those of Associate and Assistant status. The wardens of hostels are placed under the chairman of the Hall Management Committee in the organization. IIT Kharagpur receives comparatively more funding than other engineering colleges in India. While the total government funding to most other engineering colleges is around 100 rupees minus 200 million, $2 minus 4.5 million per year, IIT Kharagpur gets nearly 1,300 million rupees, $30 million per year. Other sources of funds include student fees and research funding by industry-sponsored projects. IIT Kharagpur provides scholarships to all M.Tech students and research scholars to encourage them to pursue higher studies. 
The cost borne by undergraduate students, including boarding and mess expenses, is around two rupees seventy-five thousand four thousand one hundred and ten dollars per annum. Thirty-five percent of undergraduate students are given additional financial support based on personal need and economic background, with their annual expenses being nearly sixty-four thousand rupees nine hundred and seventy-five dollars. The academic policies of IIT Kharagpur are decided by its senate. It consists of all professors of the institute, and administrative and student representatives. The Senate controls and approves the curriculum, courses, examinations and results, and appoints committees to look into specific academic matters. The teaching, training and research activities of the Institute are periodically reviewed by the Senate to maintain educational standards. The director of IIT Kharagpur is the ex officio chairman of the Institute Senate. IIT Kharagpur follows the credit-based system of performance evaluation, with proportional weighting of courses based on their importance. The total marks, usually out of 100, form the basis of grades, with a grade value, out of 10, assigned to a range of marks. For each semester, the students are graded by taking a weighted average from all the courses with their respective credit points. Each semester's evaluation is done independently with a cumulative grade point average CGPA, reflecting the average performance across semesters. Topic. Campus IIT Kharagpur is located 120 km 75 miles west of Kolkata. The campus is located 5 km away from Kharagpur's railway station. The layout of the present campus and the design of the buildings were carried out by a group of engineers and architects under the guidance of Werner M. Moser, a Swiss architect. The 4.7 square kilometers, 1200 acres campus is residence to about 22,000 inhabitants. In 2015, IIT Kharagpur had about 605 faculty members, 1,933 employees and approximately 10,010 students living on the campus. The campus has a total of 55 kilometers, 34 miles of roadways. The institute plans to go green by 2020. The 22 student hostels are located on either side of Scholars Avenue, which extends from the institute gate to the BC Roy Technology Hospital. The three earliest halls, Patel, Azad, and Nehru, together constitute the Pan Loop or Old Campus, which is located just next to Scholars Avenue. There are 10 hostels for undergraduate male students um, Pounds, RP, RK, MS, LLR, HJB, Patel, Azad and Nehru, and 2 for undergraduate female students SN, IG and MT. There are a few postgraduate students' hostels including four for women RLB, Gokli, Nivedita and Sam, and hostels for research scholars BCR, VS, BRH and JCB, and a separate hostel for scholars from the armed forces. The JNAN Ghosh Stadium and Tata Sports Complex host large-scale sports competitions. The Tagore Open Air Theatre has a capacity of 6,000 people, and is used to host cultural programs. 
The Science and Technology Entrepreneurs Park STEP, provides infrastructure facilities to alumni who want to become entrepreneurs but lack infrastructure to start their own corporation. In addition to the main campus at Kharagpur, the institute has an extension center at Kolkata to provide venues for continuing education programs, distance learning courses, and guesthouse accommodation. Accommodation. The institute plans to expand the Kolkata Extension Center at Rajahat, and use it to offer full-time undergraduate and postgraduate courses from the 2008 session onwards. The 10-acre Rajahat campus will house 2,500 students, and will eventually expand to 250 acres 1 square kilometers. The institute's plan for a similar branch campus of 200 acres 0 .81 square kilometers in Bhubaneswar was scrapped following rejection by the Union Human Resource and Development Ministry. Topic. Academic buildings IIT Kharagpur has 19 academic departments, 8 multidisciplinary centers, schools, and 13 schools of excellence in addition to more than 25 central research and development units. Apart from the main building in the central academic complex, the Srinivasa Ramanujan complex also has common academic facilities. In the SR complex, the Takshashila building houses the GS Sanyal School of Telecommunication, the School of Information Technology and the Computer and Informatics Center, and has facilities for conducting lecture classes as well. Vikramshila is another academic building in the SR complex, having four lecture halls, several seminar rooms, and Kalidas Auditorium, which has a seating capacity of 850. The School of Medical Science and Technology is housed in the basement of the Vikramshila building. The institute main building houses most of the administrative offices, the lecture halls, and two auditoriums on either side. The signage at the front displays the message, Dedicated to the service of the nation. The tower of the main building has a steel tank with 10,000 imperial gallons of water capacity for emergency supply needs. The Neetaji Auditorium in the main building is used for official functions and events, and doubles as a cinema theatre on weekend nights, showing films to the IIT community at subsidised rates. IIT Karagpa's first library was located in a small room of the Institute's old building, Shahid Barwan. At the time of its opening in 1951, the library had a collection of 2,500 books. Now located in the main building of the Institute, the Central Library is one of the largest of its type. Its collection includes over 350,000 books and documents, and it subscribes to more than 1,600 printed and online journals and conference proceedings. The library has six halls and a section exclusively for SC and SAINT students. The library's collection consists of books, reports, conference proceedings, back volumes of periodicals, standards, theses, micro-forms, DVDs, CD-ROMs, and audiovisual material. The library's transaction service is automated and online searches are possible through an online public access catalogue 
The Electronic Library section has a collection of databases, video lectures and miscellaneous other resources. The Nehru Museum of Science and Technology has over a hundred indoor exhibits that include technical models collected from institutions across India. The park outside the museum contains 14 open-air demonstrations and outdoor exhibits, including a hunter plane and a steam engine. The museum has an archive room, showing documents relating to the history of the Institute and West Midnapur district. The Rural Museum, located in the Rural Development Center of the Institute, has a collection of exhibits in local culture. Topic. Civic amenities. The Institute campus has six guest houses, a civic hospital, four nationalized banks, four schools, a railway reservation counter and a police station. The campus has a water pumping station, electrical substation, telephone exchange, a market, six restaurants, and a garbage disposal section for the daily needs of the residents. Construction is going on for another guest house and a convention center having a capacity of 2,000. The institute draws its supply of water from wells near the Kosai River, located 112 kilometers away from institute, by harnessing subsurface water. Three deep wells near the institute supplement the supply from the river. The water is supplied by a 16-inch mm pipeline to 12 tanks in the campus with a total capacity of 2,800,000 litres imperial gallons. However students have recently shown dissatisfaction with the current level of amenities, especially the civic hospital, forcing the director to resign. IIT Kharagpur is located just outside the town of Kharagpur, in the Hijli village. The civic amenities provided to the campus of IIT Kharagpur make it nearly self-sufficient with regards to the basic needs of the residents. As Kharagpur is a small town, there is limited direct interaction between the campus community and the town. There is also little opportunity for the employment of family members of the faculty. Unlike some other IITs, such as IIT Bombay, IIT Kharagpur does not restrict outsiders' entry into the campus. IIT Kharagpur provides much of its benefits to the local community through the Rural Development Center RDC, located in the campus. Established in 1975, the RDC helps the local community by developing customized technologies. The RDC also coordinates the National Service Scheme NSS programs in IIT Kharagpur, with the members of NSS taking part in weekly community service activities such as sanitation, road construction, teaching and building educational models. In 2005, IIT Kharagpur started construction of a boundary wall for the security of the campus, which is now complete. Mild restrictions apply to entry of outside vehicles. The boundary wall was opposed by the local community as it would hinder their access to amenities provided by the institute. Campus residents have also been denied direct access to the adjoining Hajli Railway Station as a result of this wall. 
The local community opposed the construction of a flyover from the railway station to the campus formally, under the pretext that it would lead to substantial losses of opportunity for the shops along the roads. After the flyover construction had been completed and became operational, things ensued in a manner as the local community had anticipated, but the flyover has resulted in more convenience for transport. The construction of the 1,052.69 meters long flyover was approved by the Indian Railways and West Bengal State Government. It's called Hajli Road Overbridge, and was constructed for estimated cost of 237 million rupees, 5.3 million dollars. Topic: Academics. Admission to most undergraduate and postgraduate courses in IIT Kharagpur is granted through written entrance examinations. Admissions to MS by research and PhD programs are based on written tests followed by personal interviews. Admission to undergraduate programs in all IITs was tied to the Indian Institute of Technology Joint Entrance Examination IITG. Candidates who qualify for admission through IITG used to apply for admission in four-year B.Tech Bachelor of Technology, five-year Barch degree, five-year dual degree, Integrated Bachelor of Technology and Master of Technology, and five-year Integrated MSc Master of Sciences courses at IIT Kharagpur. Starting from 2013, admission was done on the basis of two exams, G Mains and G Advance. Students who qualified for G Mains got the opportunity to appear for G Advance, and scores of this exams are considered for the admission into IITs. The admissions to postgraduate programs M-Tech, are made primarily through the Graduate Aptitude Test in Engineering gate. Other postgraduate entrance exams include Joint Admission to MSc JAM, for MSc, and Common Admission Test CAT, conducted by RIMs for Management Studies. 15% of the seats are reserved for students belonging to Scheduled Castes SC, and 7.5% for Scheduled Tribes Street. As of 2008, 27% separate reservation exists for the other backward classes. IIT Kharagpur is a member of LAOTSE, a network of universities in Europe and Asia exchanging students and senior scholars. Topic. Undergraduate education IIT Kharagpur offers degrees as part of its undergraduate programs. They include Bachelor of Technology BTech, ONS, Bachelor of Architecture BARCH, and the five-year integrated Master of Science. The BTech degree is the most common undergraduate degree in IIT Kharagpur in terms of student enrollment. It is based on a four-year program with eight semesters. The first year of the B.Tech curriculum has common courses from various departments. At the end of the first year, an option to change departments is given to students on the basis of their performance in the first two semesters. 
Unlike other IITs which evaluate the students on the basis of others' performance which does not foster shared learning and communication, IIT Kharagpur uses absolute scores. From the second year onwards, the students take courses offered by the departments that are known as depth courses. In addition to these, the students take interdisciplinary courses known as breadth courses. Separate courses from the Humanities and Social Sciences HSS department, and Management and Information Technology are also required. At the end of the third year, the B.Tech and dual degree students undertake industrial training for a minimum period of eight working weeks as part of the undergraduate curriculum. In the final year of the studies, most of the students are offered jobs in industries and other organizations through the training and placement section of the institute commonly known as Career Development Center or CDC. Some students opt out of this facility in favor of higher studies or by applying to recruiting organizations directly. In addition to the major degree as part of the undergraduate education, students can take courses from other departments, and by demonstrating knowledge of a discipline based on objectives set by the department, earn a minor in that department. To stay up to date with the latest academic and industry standards, IIT Kharagpur revamps its academic curriculum periodically. In August 2017, an undergraduate council, UG council was constituted by the Institute under the Dean of Undergraduate Studies, Dean UGS, as its chairman and with one student representative from each department to be elected, nominated for an annual term, to assist in the process of curriculum update, assimilate student feedback on different academic policies and forward suggestions and proposals to the Institute Senate. Topic. Postgraduate and doctoral education IIT Kharagpur offers postgraduate programs including Master of Technology M.Tech, Master of Business Administration MBA, and Master of Sciences MSc. Some specialized postgraduate programs offered by IIT Kharagpur include Master of Human Resource Management MHRM, Postgraduate Diploma in Information Technology PGDIT, Master in Medical Science and Technology MMST, Master of City Planning MCP, LL, B in Intellectual Property Law LL, B Honors in IP law, and postgraduate diploma in Maritime Operation and Management PGDMOM. The Institute offers the Doctor of Philosophy degree PhD, as part of its doctoral education program. The doctoral scholars are given a topic by the professor, or work on the consultancy project sponsored by industry. The duration of the program is usually unspecified and depends on the discipline. PhD scholars submit a dissertation as well as conduct an oral defense of their thesis. Teaching assistantships TAR, and research assistantships RA, are provided based on the scholar's academic profile. IIT Kharagpur offers an MS by Research program, the MTech and MS being similar to the U.S. University's non-thesis course-based and thesis research-based master programs respectively. 
IIT Kharagpur, along with other IITs, offers dual degree programs that integrate undergraduate and postgraduate studies in selected pairs of branches and specializations. Most of the dual degree programs involve specialization in the major field of education of the student. For a dual degree involving an MBA from Vinod Gupta School of Management, IIT Kharagpur, the selection is made on the basis of an aptitude test of students across all engineering streams. The dual degree program spans five years as against six years in conventional B.Tech four years, followed by an M.Tech or MBA two years. IIT Kharagpur has a management school, Vinod Gupta School of Management, IIT Kharagpur, an entrepreneurship school, Rajendra Mishra School of Engineering Entrepreneurship, and a law school, Rajiv Gandhi School of Intellectual Property Law, on its premises. The Rajiv Gandhi School of Intellectual Property Law has been opened in collaboration with George Washington University. Rajiv Gandhi School of Intellectual Property Law is the only law school in IIT system of the country. The School of Medical Science and Technology in IIT Kharagpur is the first and also the only of its kind in the country where MBBS graduates are trained in art and science of medical research with aim to provide a platform for interdisciplinary teaching and research in the field of medical science and technology. IIT Kharagpur will invest around 2.30 billion rupees for its 400-bed super-specialty hospital in the campus which will impart undergraduate medical course to students. The institute is expected to start the course in 2017 which will be recognized by Medical Council of India MCI. Topic. Continuing education The Institute offers the Continuing Education Program CEP, for qualified engineers and scientists to learn technologies and developments in their academic disciplines. As part of CEP, the Institute offers formal degree programs M.Tech and Ph.D., and an early faculty induction program EFIP, under the Quality Improvement Program QIP. Short-term courses supported by the All India Council for Technical Education, self-financed short-term courses supported by course fees, and certificate courses conducted as distance education. In addition to conducting educational courses, the SEP develops model curricula for engineering education. As of 2006, the SEP has facilitated publication of 103 course curriculum books. The SEP administers SIMAP Small Industries Management Assistant Program and STUP Skill Come Technology Upgradation Program on behalf of IIT Kharagpur, the institute being a corpus institute of SIDBI Small Industries Development Bank of India. Topic sponsored research The Institute received 171 research revenue worth Rs. 417 million, 9.25 million dollars, and 130 consultancy projects in the 2005-06 session. The Institute transferred 15 technologies to industry during the same session. The Institute has filed 125 patents and 25 of them have been granted. 
This does not include patents obtained by individual professors or students. During the same session, the value of the international projects was 9.9 .9 million rupees, $220,000, and the revenue from transferred technologies was about 2.5 million rupees, $55,000. The institute earned ours. 520 million, 11.5 million dollars from research projects in the 2005-06 session. Major sponsors for research include the Indian National Science Academy, Ministry of Human Resource and Development, Defence Research and Development Organisation, Microsoft Corporation, Department of Science and Technology, Ministry of Communications and Information Technology, India, and Indian Space Research Organisation. IIT Kharagpur has had a cell known as the SRIC, Sponsored Research and Industrial Consultancy, cell since 1982. It handles sponsored research projects and industrial consultancy assignments, and has the infrastructure to simultaneously administer 600 R&D projects. Topic academic Units Departments Aerospace Engineering Agricultural and Food Engineering Architecture and Regional Planning Biotechnology Chemical Engineering Chemistry Civil Engineering Computer Science and Engineering Electrical Engineering Electronics and Electrical Communication Engineering Geology and Geophysics Humanities and Social Sciences Industrial and Systems Systems Engineering Mathematics Mechanical Engineering Metallurgical and Materials Engineering Mining Engineering Ocean Engineering and Naval Architecture Physics Centers Rubber Technology Steel Technology Center Reliability Engineering Cryogenic Engineering Materials Science Oceans, Rivers, Atmosphere and Land Sciences Rural Development Center Advanced Technology Development Center Center for Educational Technology Recce Center for Science of Happiness Daysarkar Center Excellence in Petroleum Engineering AI Center of Excellence Schools School of Medical Science and Technology GS Sanyal School of Telecommunications Rajendra Mishra School of Engineering Entrepreneurship Rajiv Gandhi School of Intellectual Property Law Ranveer and Chitra Gupta School of Infrastructure Design and Management Medical Science and Technology School of Water Resources Vinod Gupta School of Management, IIT Kharagpur Topic rankings Internationally, IIT Kharagpur was ranked 308 in the QS World University Rankings of 2018 The same rankings ranked it 62 in Asia and 24 among BRICS nations. It was ranked 501 to 600 in the world by the Times Higher Education World University Rankings of 2018, 60 in Asia and 71 among BRICS and Emerging Economies University Rankings in 2017, IIT Kharagpur ranked second among engineering colleges in India by India Today in 2017, third among engineering Engineering Colleges by Outlook India and The Week, and fourth among engineering colleges by the National Institutional Ranking Framework in 2018, which also ranked it fifth overall. The Architecture Department is ranked first among all architecture colleges in India by National Institutional Ranking Framework in 2018. In 2018. Rajiv Gandhi School of Intellectual Property Law is ranked fourth among law schools in India by National Institutional Ranking Framework in 2018. 
The Vinod Gupta School of Management was ranked seventh among management schools in India by NIRF in 2018, 15 by Business Today's India's Best B Schools 2016. Topic: Placements at IIT Kharagpur. The international placements began in 2006. Two foreign companies, oil giants Schlumbergerand, visited IIT Kharagpur that year and offered annual salaries to the tune of $80,000. The reason for late international placements was that earlier the IIT, it had to abandon its policy. The top domestic compensation in 2008 came in at 1.8 million rupees per annum. In 2011 batch, Goldman Sachs recruited 10 students on a package of 2.6 million rupees $36,000 per annum. Barclays Capital recruited 11 students with a package of 2 million rupees $28,000 per annum in December 2009. The highest salary offered till now is 17 million rupees $240,000 per annum by social networking site Facebook in an offshore recruitment, of which employee stock ownership plans ESOPs were offered valued at 10 million rupees in December 2010. The 2010 batch of BTEC students saw 94% placements while the remaining preferred IIMs or entrepreneurship. Deutsche Bank recruited nine students on a package of 1.5 million rupees $21,000 per annum. For 2012 batch, Facebook has made the highest offer $150,000 to four students. For 2013 batch, three students have bagged salaries of 8 million rupees $110,000 a year while eight others have got offers of 7.5 million rupees $100,000 from Google, Facebook and Microsoft. For 2014 batch, the highest package offered to a student stands at around 9 million rupees $130,000 from Google. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Student life and culture. Topic Halls of Residence IIT Kharagpur provides on-campus residential facilities to its students, research scholars, faculty members and many of its staff. The students live in hostels referred to as halls throughout their stay in the IIT. Hostel rooms are wired for internet, for which students pay a compulsory charge. Most of the rooms in the older halls of residences are designed to accommodate one student, but due to scarcity of sufficient student accommodation, two students share the single-seater room in first two years. The new rooms of Lal Bahada Shastri Hall and new blocks of few other hall of residence accommodate three students in one room. The halls of IIT Kharagpur are, Ashutosh Mukherjee Hall Azad Hall Bidhan Chandra Roy Hall B.R. Ambedkar Hall Gokul Hall Homi Jahangir Bhava Hall J.C. Bose Hall Lala Lajpat Rai Hall Lal Bahada Shastri Hall Madan Mohan Malviya Hall Meghnad Sahar Hall Mother Teresa Hall Nehru Hall Patel Hall Radha Krishnan Hall Rajendra Prasad Hall 
Hall Rani Laxmabai Hall Sarojini Naidu, Indira Gandhi Hall Vikram Sarabhai Residential Complex Vidyasagar Hall Zakir Hussain Hall Sister Nivedita Hall of Residence Undergraduates Students choose between National Cadet Corps NCC, National Service Scheme NSS, and National Sports Organization NSO, for their first two years of study. IIT Kharagpur has common sports grounds for cricket, football, hockey, one court for volleyball, two for lawn tennis, four indoor badminton court, tracks for athletics, and swimming pools for aquatic events. Most of the hostels have their own sports grounds. The institute used to organize Shaurya, an annual intercollegiate sports and games meet during October which was discontinued in 2012 The students of IIT Kharagpur compete among themselves in various events held under the purview of Open IIT and Inter Hall events, and the results of the latter contribute to the points that determine the winner of general championship. The four categories in which general championships are decided are sports, social and cultural activities, technology, and hall affairs. The women's hostel together participate as a single team in all events with the exception of sports, where women's team do not participate at inter-hall level. IIT Kharagpur participates in the Inter IIT Sports Meet, held annually in one of the IITs by policy of rotation. The students choose their representatives by elections held under the control of the technology students Gymkhana, a fortnightly newsletter called The Scholars Avenue, named after the avenue common to the student halls, is also published by an independent student body. A Hindi monthly newsletter Awaz is also published by another independent student body. Individual halls organize Hall Day, an annual event that involves lighting and decoration of the organizing hall, with a social gathering of students from all halls, during March. The event is also used by the halls to popularize their candidates for student body elections. Students who violate the code of conduct of the institute have to defend themselves in front of the Hall Disciplinary Committee HDC, which investigates the case and prescribes punishment if necessary. Students may appeal against the punishment to the Appellate Cum Liaison Committee known as Inter-Hall Disciplinary Committee IHDC. The IHDC submits its recommendations to the Senate, which finalizes the punishment. Extreme cases of indiscipline are referred directly to the IHDC. The IHDC is empowered to give punishments to students for acts of indiscretion committed anywhere in India. IIT Kharagpur has strict provisions dealing with physical and mental harassment of junior students ragging. Students found harassing their juniors are suspended from the institute, without going through the disciplinary committee. <laughs> Festivals IIT Kharagpur has festivals like Spring Fest, Kshati. Spring Fest, the annual socio-cultural fest of IIT Kharagpur is the largest student-managed socio-cultural fest of Asia. It is held in January. 
Spring Fest includes cultural competitions in addition to stage shows, known as Star Nights by singers and performers such as Sunadi Chowan, Farhan Akhtar, Salim Suleiman, Vishal Shekhar, KK, Pritam, Kailash Kacha, Shan, Breathe, Led Zeppelin, Parakrama, Indian Ocean etc. The magnitude of Spring Fest is huge and attracts participation from more than 150 colleges across India. IIT Kharagpur organizes a techno management festival known as Kashati. It is the biggest techno management festival of Asia with a total budget of more than 15 million and a total prize money worth 5 million rupees. An annual techno management festival organized in January or February, it receives participation from foreign universities as well. Events include technical workshops, seminars, and competitions, to keep students updated with modern technology and address the curiosity the institute collaborates with other institutes to organize conferences and seminars, robotics, the annual robotics competition held by IIT Kharagpur, is organized during Kashati. IIT Kharagpur organizes an annual intercollegiate sports and games meet known as Shaurya. It is held in the autumn semester in October. Events include cricket, hockey, volleyball, basketball, badminton, table tennis, lawn tennis and aquatics. Workshops for archery, boxing and handball are held. The Department of Computer Science and Engineering organizes Bitwise IIT Kharagpur, an online programming contest annually in February. Programming and algorithmic challenges are given in a span of 12 hours. In Bitwise 2011, 5,000 teams participated from 80 countries. Bitwise 2012 was held on 12 February 2012. In January the Entrepreneurship Cell organizes a Global Entrepreneurship Summit, which consists of guest lectures, workshops, a startup camp and other events relating to entrepreneurship and starting up. There are also other department festivals like Esperanza, organized by Department of Electronics and Electrical Communication Engineering, Prithvi, organized by Department of Geology, a petroleum-themed technical fest, Petrofiesta, is organized in the month of November by the Society of Petroleum Engineers IIT Kharagpur Chapter. This is a one-of-a-kind fest which provides a platform for students from all over the country to compete and share their ideas and knowledge in the field of petroleum industry. Topic. Student organizations Topic. Autonomous Ground Vehicle AGV, Research Group, IIT Kharagpur Team AGV IIT Kharagpur is one of the most well-established robotics research groups in Indian universities. Sponsored by SRIC, IIT Kharagpur as part of Center for Excellence in Robotics, it has been at the forefront of robotics research in the campus. The aim of the group is to build a successful self-driving car for Indian roads. The team has tasted success in international competitions like Intelligent Ground Vehicle Competition, placing second in 2018 and sixth in 2013. 
The team is also a top 13 participant of the Mahindra Rise Prize SDC Challenge. The group performs cutting-edge research in field of robot design, robot control, computer vision, simultaneous localization and mapping, AI and motion planning. The group is headed by Professor Debashish Chakravarti. A group spin-off startup, SF Bay Area-based Oro Robotics, now acquired by RideCell, is at the forefront of self-driving car research around the world. Topic: Karagpur Robosoccer Students Group (KRSSG). Karagpur Robosoccer Students Group, abbreviated to KRSSG, is one of IIT Karagpur's first endeavors in robotics research. It is a research group sponsored by SRIC as part of Center for Excellence in Robotics. The aim of the research group is to make autonomous soccer playing robots and participate in international competitions like RoboCup and Federation of International Robot Soccer Association FIRA, Robo World Cup. Students from all departments and years have been part of this including undergraduates and postgraduates. The principal investigator for the project is Professor Jayanta Mukhopadhyay alongside Professor A.K. Deb, Professor D.K. Pratia and Professor Sudeshna Sarkar. KRSSG participated in FIRA 2013 Malaysia, FIRA 2014 Beijing, China and FIRA 2015 Dijon, South Korea, winning the bronze medal. Recently it also participated in the 3D Humanoid Simulation League 2016 held in Leipzig, Germany, winning 7th position. Topic Team Kart Karagpur Automobile Racing Team Karagpur Automobile Racing Team, better known as Team Kart, is a group of students who like to explore the practical side of automotive engineering. The team designs and builds Formula Student prototype race cars and represents IIT Karagpur at Formula Student UK. It was founded in 2008 and has made three cars since, the KX1, the K1 and the K2. K2 secured a rank of 67th out of 120 teams worldwide at Formula Student UK 2013. Several design oversights in K2 were fixed in K2.2 by a new chassis and intake exhaust system. The team participated in FDC 2015 and passed technical scrutiny and took part in dynamic events securing the first runners-up position in business presentation and cost report, second in business plan presentation and second in cost and manufacturing report. Construction of K3 is ongoing. Topic. Gopali Youth Welfare Society Gopali Youth Welfare Society is a government-registered NGO run by students of IIT Kharagpur with the help of professors of IIT Kharagpur and local members of Gopali village. The main initiative of GYWS is an English medium school, Jagriti Vidya Mandir. Quality education is provided absolutely free of cost to underprivileged children. The school is located in Tangasol village, Salua outside the IIT Kharagpur campus. 
There are about 200 students enrolled in the school from nursery to class 5 books, uniform and transportation is provided to the kids. Topic: <laughs> Entrepreneurship Cell Entrepreneurship Cell, e -Cell is a student's organization, functioning under STEP, Science and Technology Entrepreneurs Park, from within the institute, with the aim of promoting entrepreneurship among students throughout India. It provides mentoring and support to startup companies and helps them with financing, through venture capitalists and incubation, through STEP and SRIC, IIT Kharagpur. It conducts two major events, the Global Entrepreneurship Summit GES, which is a three-day event, held in January at the Institute, and the Entrepreneurship Awareness Drive EAD, a 20-day event, consisting of guest lectures in 20 cities across India. Knowledge Camp is conducted annually for the benefit of students within IIT KGP, while the Innovation Platform and Fund a KGP and programs continue throughout the year, to recognize and support innovative ideas among students of IIT KGP, besides workshops and guest lectures throughout the year. Professors Sunil Handa, Padma Shri Anil K. Gupta, Sanjeev Bhakchandani, Vinod Dham, Arjun Malhotra, Rajat Sharma and Kiran Mazumdar Shah are some of the speakers who have delivered lectures within and outside IIT KGP. E-Cell has been instrumental in the establishment of Rajendra Mishra School of Engineering Entrepreneurship. The E-Cell has played a key role in the Deferred Placement Program DPP, whereby, a student can opt for placement a year after the completion of his, her course, in case they are involved in a startup company. This is the first time such a program is being offered at the undergraduate level in India. Topic. Space Technology Student Society Space Technology Student Society SPATS, is a student initiative that functions as the student body of Kalpana Chawla Space Technology Cell KCSTC, the contact point of Indian Space Research Organization ISRO, at IIT Kharagpur. It hosts an annual space festival, National Student Space Challenge. SPATS has been constantly instrumental in organizing space-themed talks, sky-gazing sessions, lectures and presentations within IIT Kharagpur. The group publishes a bi-semester newsletter, The Moonwalk, on latest ventures in space technology and various astronomy-related articles. Topic. Megalith, the annual civil engineering tech fest Megalith is the annual technical fest of the Department of Civil Engineering, Indian Institute of Technology, Kharagpur held under the aegis of the Civil Engineering Society, IIT Kharagpur and the patronage of the Institution of Civil Engineers UK, IIT Kharagpur Chapter. Since its inception in 2009, Megalith has conquered a huge success in the field of engineering engineering and corporate sector and has grown as largest civil engineering technical fest of India, offering a diverse range of competitions, workshops and guest lectures. Topic. Technology Filmmaking and Photography Society 
Technology Filmmaking and Photography Society is the Students' Interest Club of IIT Kharagpur which aims to provide a platform to students interested in filmmaking and photography to work together and pursue their interests. The Society also organizes special screenings of acclaimed independent films and workshops, inviting industry professionals. Biswapati Sarkar of TVF fame is one of the founding members of the Society. Alumni of the Society have gone on to produce critically acclaimed documentaries and films such as The Unreserved and pursuing careers in filmmaking, media and advertising. Alumni. <laughs> 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 Alumni Institute Interaction is maintained through the Alumni Network under the aegis of the Dean of Alumni Affairs and International Relations, his office staff and student representatives. It also helps in conducting the annual alumni meets. Notable alumni Arvind Kejriwal, Chief Minister of Delhi Sundar Pichai, CEO of Google Ajit Jain, Berkshire Hathaway Srikumar Banerjee, former director, director of Bhava Atomic Research Center Bark. Arjun Malhotra, co-founder of HCL Technologies Mani Lal Bormak, Indian-born American physicist Partha Pratim Chakraborty, Director, IIT Kharagpur. Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar Awardee Suman Chakrabarti, Professor, Department of Computer Science and Eng, IIT Bombay. Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar Awardee Mahir Kanti Chowdhury, Vice Chancellor of Tezpur University, Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar Laureate, Subhasis Chowdhury, Electrical Engineer, Academic, Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar Laureate, Rono Dutta, Former CEO of United Airlines. Vinod Gupta, founder and former chairman and CEO of Infogroup Kiran Seth, founder SPIC MACAY Raj Kamal Jha, chief editor, The Indian Express, and writer Pradeep K. Kosler, 8th Chancellor of University of California, San Diego S. Rao Kosaraju, developed Kosaraju's algorithm, which finds the strongly connected components of a directed graph. Arup Kumar Raychowdhury, condensed matter physicist, Shanti Swarup Bhatnaga laureate. Aranav Kumar, CEO and co founder of the Viral Fever. Biswapati Sarkar, co-founder of the Viral Fever Jatendra Kumar, co-founder of the Viral Fever Narendra Kumar, physicist, Padma Shri recipient Kumarendra Malik, geophysicist, Shanti Swarup Bhatnaga laureate Sankar Kumar Nath, geophysicist, Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar laureate Janardhan Ganpatrao Negi, theoretical geophysicist, Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar laureate Surendra Prasad, communications engineer, Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar laureate Jaikumar Radhakrishnan, former Dean, TIFR Bombay. Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar Awardee. K. Radhakrishnan, Chairman, ISRO, India 2009 
Basanta Kumar Sahu, mathematical geologist, Shanti Swarup Bhatnaga laureate Aaron Saran, former CEO of Vodafone Dovuri Subarao, 22nd Governor of Reserve Bank of India Biswa Kalyan Rath, stand-up comedian Topic: Alumni initiatives. The Vinod Gupta School of Management (VGSOM) and Rajiv Gandhi School of Intellectual Property Law were established with donated funds from Vinod Gupta, founder, Info Group, along with support from the Government of India. VGSOM started in 1993 with a batch of 30 students. Other centers built by funding from alumni include the GS. Sanyal School of Telecommunication and VLSI CAD Laboratory. The IIT Foundation, started by Vinod Gupta in 1992, is the alumni association of the institute with chapters in cities in India and abroad. Subrata Gupta is the director of West Bengal Industrial Development Corporation. The Alumni Association publishes the quarterly newsletter KGPN for the alumni. The Institute also publishes a monthly e-newsletter titled KGP Connection for Alumni. IIT Kharagpur has a Dean for Alumni Affairs to manage liaisons with alumni. The US-based alumni of IIT Kharagpur have started the Vision 2020 fundraiser, to provide infrastructure, like labs and equipment, and attract and retain faculty and students. The objective of Vision 2020 is to raise a $200 million endowment fund by the year 2020 for technology education, research and innovation-related growth of the Institute. On 20 April 2013 ex-graduates from IIT Kharagpur formed a group Kharagpur in Mumbai group and held a meeting in Bandra, Mumbai to chalk out the easiest and pragmatic ways", on how they can given back to society. 